Hello and welcome back to Supermarché. That's the game, the PMP game that I play. And the bankrupt store that I have named. We are going for the next round. Uh, no, no doodling around here. You might not know it, but there are only 30 customers. Five each time, six rounds. So, yeah. Uh, and there's only six of these. I'll still go with those two. It feels like that's a good thing. Well, we'll see. Now, with the two first customers up, you can see what there might be. Bakery, uh, dairy is the ones that you might go out and check. Now, dry foods, we have quite some. Uh, or at least I'm pleased with what we what we have. Now I need to buy a lot. First of all, I will take all three of these. And produce is one buck. So that's not that far. Dry goods is six, so I'm going to go with none this time. But I see that both bakery and dairy is down at two bucks. So we should probably I'll get all four. Um four, five, six. That one is going to be uh, out this time. <coughs> So that's eight bucks. Do do. I'm going to do another eight bucks on uh, bakery. Um, mostly because I feel like it's time to do it. Um, we'll see. I might do I might do it wrong, but that's how it is. So that's another eight bucks. Down to eighty again. <laughs> um I haven't been doing any dairy sale. I'm thinking about doing it and expand that. I also need a lot of frozen. Let's see, I have three uh, 11 I can have nine of those if I want to I'll take four they cost four that's 16 bucks yep <laughs> well as you can see I've already been doing a lot but I don't think this is enough Um. I'm checking how many have I in total. If I'm doing a dairy sale, I have two guys who don't have coupons. So I could put them on a dairy sale. Eat, none of them is actually very interested in dairy. I mean, if I sell them for two bucks and buy them for two bucks, it doesn't sound like reasonable, but I feel like I should. No, not move that one. So I'll take these and make another four bucks back. Hmm. Yeah, we'll most likely do that. Now that's enough. Sorry, Loris, you can go away now. Okay, now remember we can restock. So, doing stuff my way or not. These should be over here. And two of these. We can put there. Bakery. Should I do only do two? And more frozen. Uh, 
that should be 15 right 6 9 12 15 yes good the thing is I didn't sell any dry goods last time that's so that's so strange let's open the bankrupt store let's start with no Jordan Hello Jordan, we have a sale on dairy today. Yes, take one, please do. That's nice. Good. That's only two bucks, but I I don't care. And then he will roll his dice. Nine, frozen. That's another seven bucks. Thank you. Ten, yet another no that's a uh, dry goods good, 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 good. that's the best thing we can sell <laughs> okay Jordan is up and running away thank you mr. sir put them over that no not there uh, next customer oh dear so we now, if we can do this, we can get an extra nine bucks. But he also has a coupon. Well, Zoe, it's my turn to make dinner for the boys down at the fire station. Well, they should have some of my dairy products. Absolutely. They would love that. Two bucks. <laughs> And then we, I see you have a coupon, my dear. Let's see what we can get for you. An 8 is dry goods. And an 8 is 7 and 12. That's bakery and produce. <laughs> of course you are going to have one of these and one of these. Absolutely, dear. That's only 7 bucks minus 2. That's a fiver. Um, now she only had one coupon. Alas, a four. That's a frozen. Okay, yet another seven bucks. It's going well. And hopefully, if we can get this one in, nine dairy. Oh dear. <laughs> okay, a dairy. Um, that we have on sale so it's two bucks more good and then we get our nine extra because we can on the other hand if we lost this one and I usually do that's a minus 13 that is a lot that is a lot 106 bucks I am so pleased flip hey Stu here he is <laughs> some frozen pizzas and I'll be set for a week <laughs> now <coughs> as you can see I only have two but Scott on the other hand doesn't use that at all hold it hold it hold it what can he not eat he can't do dairy so no 7-eleven do we need to stock already well let's do that let's stock up should I take them all no I only take two now everything there should be there that should be nice that one we'll take out and that one we will take out I should have bought more frozen. Dang it. Well, that's how it is. If you can do a round without losing any customer, that is the best way to do it. But now I've done all the sales, at least that's good. Okay. Let's see. Let's do Scott. Scott seems to be the one that I want to minus six well that's nice 
he's not using any of those. A five, that's a produce, thank you. Three bucks, put it over there by the way. I think we're safe. I can't see it, see that it goes totally wrong. Oh dear, I have something in my eye. That really isn't good. And we got a six, that's yet another produce. Hey, are you going to take all my produce? Well, that's good. Thank you, Scott. That's another three bucks. It's not much, but it is what it is. Okay, so we can't do much about that. Uh, we flip this and look at Leslie. Now she is actually having produce by between six and eight. Dang it. I don't work here, but let me help you find what you need. <laughs> okay, let's take stew. I'm totally confident in stew. Oh, he wants some frozen pizzas. <laughs> oh, he wants some frozen pizzas. Well, that's 14 bucks. He will set for a week. <laughs> 14 bucks plus uh, that's 26 I think I have a new record coming good thank you Stu welcome back okay Les I'm having a bit of a problem I should have taken more stuff but well we'll see let's not jump to conclusions hold it we have sale still right I had oh I didn't put this one on uh, so let's make him take one of these at least it's only two bucks but still it's better than nothing uh, and then he should start rolling and he will find produce and that's not there so he doesn't want this one either and that's a minus two plus that that one gets into the bin uh, which means that I lose yet another five bucks and I'm down to 120 well that's how it is sometimes you win sometimes you lose I was just hoping six to eight as I said that's the most common one to do uh, we have no produce this time. Minus. We only had that one. Good. That's pretty good. Okay, I like that. Let's do next day. Next round. And we get yet another customer or two or three or five. And the distribution is on. And it's produce time again, but this time frozen is up but to four. I don't like that. You can co compare them, but yes, but it was four last time too. And we again put <laughs> these two up. <laughs> Hopefully that's good. And we have Martha with the coupon. Diane does not. Okay. Time for delivery. Um... Even if Stu has been here taking his pizzas, I still want these. 16 buck back. Um, we should at least get three produce. It's down to one dollar, so it's not like it's a big thing. Um, that bakery is actually going out this round <laughs> and I have two more already dairy is not that good uh, we need some more dry goods
Now, since these are four rounds and I only have two rounds left, <coughs> they will not expire. So that's why it's going here immediately. Three of those costs three bucks. Can't see three bucks. That's yet another nine. I need to buy stuff. That's how it is. Uh, then we have five, we have four, three, three, I'll take two more bakery. Uh, bakery was two bucks, that's four yet, another one, four, and I'll take two dairy. More. There is three bucks and that's another six. I think that should be safe. See, I'm counting how many do I have in both camps. This is not 20, right? Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fourteen. Eighteen. I can buy two more and there's no problem. And the only one thing that is cheap is either bakery or produce. Never have more than three produce. I have had four. Bakery I have six of. Dairy I have five. Let's take one more of these. Yet another four bucks. We are down to 80 again. Well, that's how it is. Good. That's the distribution. No sale. No sale. We don't want that. Uh, these are expiring after this round. And so do these. That's always nice to know. Let's put out two of these. We can only have 15, as you probably already know. So, diary, diary is up there. And I think should be down there. I have four frozen. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, and uh, let's take one more of those because these are also expiring. Oh, we need to sell a lot of bakery. <laughs> Well, that's how it is. Okay, we have opened the bankrupt store again. Yay! Who wants to start? Perhaps Martha would like to start this time. It is me who is deciding that, of course, nobody else. So, we start with an 11, that's a frozen, or a 2-9. Two, 2 is bakery and dairy. Bakery and dairy. Please. That's good. Bakery and a dairy. So that's eight bucks minus two because it was on a coupon. Six bucks. Thank you, my love. There we go. Nikolai. He's also a coupon guy. But it seems like I need to do four rolls on Diane, so I'll do that. A six, that's a bakery. Good, 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 good. It's going to expire this time. A ten, that's bakery. Are you going to buy my whole bakery store? Eight, that's also bakery. I don't have that. So it's a minus seven. And these two are going in the bin. Yet another two. Dang! I was hoping. I was hoping. Uh, should we restock that one? It depends. They are having seven bakery. Well, let's do Wendell. Hopefully it's 
good. He's not rolling a seven, right? He's rolling an eight. Produce, good, good. It's only three bucks, but it's better than nothing. Uh, thank you, Wendell. What does it say? I have a need, new new joke for you. What does Nikolai say? How could they possibly be out of pierogies? <laughs> I have no idea. And Jackie. Oh, here we have a double one. Ma'am, just because I'm over 30 doesn't make me a ma'am. <laughs> well. <clears throat> we are trying to be polite here in our little store. Okay. Uh... So he's out. Did I get my three bucks? I don't think so. There. Put those over there. Now let's see. Now it's time to restock. No talk about it. Restock. Time to restock with two, two guys still left three and we have three and we have uh, that one and uh, that one now we have 15 already two of those and four of those and then three of the others that is still good and these never expires right let's see we start with the coupon guy I think we need to have it over where the dies are he starts with a seven that's a bakery now or it's a three eight dairy frozen oh dear no I decide he wants to have his bakery that's four bucks and then he rolls his die again a nine that's a frozen good seven bucks more and Nikolai is pleased thank you Jackie ma'am <laughs> Ma'am, what do you want? Dry goods or uh, 6 11. 6 is produce, 11 is frozen. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. I want to sell my dry goods because they are going to be out next time. So I'll do that one, and it's also 10 bucks. As soon as I, as long as I have everything, nine is also a dry goods. Oh, thank you, thank you, ma'am. Ma'am, I'm not over thirty. Good heavens! Okay, perhaps a second coupon. Six. That's a produce or four. Produce and a frozen. Well, why not a frozen? And a produce, it's only 10 bucks. Minus 2 is an 8 bucks. And we are through. Thank you, ma'am. <laughs> and we actually saved these two from going out. Dear, dear, dear. Right, I'm looking at the clock and I see that I need to do a run for the last one. Good. Uh, one produce out minus one. Um, six, never, never, never six. Good. Um, ah, I did a good run there. Come on six and last one and we also do a waste run with that the last five shoppers customers and that's it and the last 
distribution center. Hopefully we are going to be okay. Amanda and Clara has a coupon. Okay. Produce is still up. Oh dear, frozen is actually costing a lot. But I do have four frozen this time. If I want to have five of each last round, it's not that much to ask for. But I also don't want to waste all my m money on just buying stuff that will be laying in the store after sixth round. So you have to be very careful on how to do this. I have four of the dairy. Well, we start with three produce. It's probably the only thing we really know. And it's three bucks. Uh, I feel like we need to do yet another dairy. That's three bucks. Uh, there's a cup. Let's should we take all three? Yeah, and that's six bucks. Um, we have. I'll take one dry goods. That's four. That keeps me all over hundred bucks. <laughs> all right. Right, right, right. That's good. That's enough. That's enough. We don't need more. Let's stock our little shop. Start with the produce as usual. We hopefully are fine with only four of these. Um, we need three of these. You only have four or three already. And one of those. Now these two are expiring after round six and these two as well. Those two and that one also. Rest is safe. Good. That's enough. I'm not wasting more money on you. Dang thing. Okay. Let's see, who shall we start with? Should we start with Clara? Yeah, let's do that. She's got a coupon. It's always nice to have a coupon because that means that I can choose. Okay, she needs a produce or 611. 611 is dairy produce. That's five bucks, but produce is only three bucks. So I actually take that. Um, I'll take that. That's two less that I need to do something about. Uh, that's seven, that's five bucks. Good. That's the coupon. Four dry goods. Thank you, my lady. And we are... 10 bucks more. This is going so well. Clara, goodbye there. Um, Rose also got a coupon. But she's more into Frozen. Let's take her. Hopefully we'll get what we want. Uh, 8. That's dry goods. Or 7.12. Which is frozen and bakery. No, I'll take a dry goods. That's 10 bucks. Hopefully we are going to do the coupon thing next time. As long as there are still two th places left in the cart, it should be fine. And it's a five. That's dairy or 210, which is produce and dry goods. I'll take that one actually. That is 13 minus 1, 2. That's 11. And we get to 
78. Thank you, Rose. Nice having you as a customer. Oh dear. Here we have Dave. Okay, this might be a bit of a problem. Um, I don't have enough stuff to sell. <laughs> this is not going the way I wanted it. I think I restock as much as I can. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I need five more. Well, I do really need this one. Um, and that one, right? Five, ten, no. Can have one more. I am totally ruining myself. <laughs> well, <laughs> that should be a good thing. But Dave is going to cost me 12 bucks. Unless, of course, I'm able to convince him of the coupon problem. Or should I do the Amanda first? Don't tell my husband. I'm cheating on my diet what I hope this store has pizza sauce we're gonna make homemade pizzas tonight okay um, then you need more bakery much bakery and dairy you only need bakery and dairy right let's take this one out because I feel like it's a big problem it's minus 12 if I can just save this one I would be very happy. Start with a 12, that's a frozen. Or 3.8, which is produce and dry goods, which is not what I want to sell. So we'll take a frozen. Oh dear. And that is a 7 bucks, but I don't fix that because I know it's going to go totally wrong so I don't do that seven is a dairy or three eight three eight is a produce and dry goods we don't need that so we take a dairy and that one expired so yes now we can't use both his coupons four four is an eight dry goods or 712 that's a dairy and a frozen dairy and a frozen okay this is going to go so strange now remember dairy and a frozen in this case it's uh, nine bucks so so far I should be able to get 16 20 bucks at the at the moment perhaps I should probably get that one up that's where I am at where I am now but he still has one more place in his cart oh dear oh dear oh dear of eight that's dry goods and that's the last one so we saved those no not there stupid you're not money uh, so we got yet another tenner and we saved our skin and bacon and have a nice pizza evening, sir. Now these two is going to be the problem because now I need to give them something and we don't have anything left in the store. It's not what I thought I should do. Okay, let's see. Uh, I'll just throw those ones away. We are going to go back. Go dry on these ones. I can tell you that much. But hopefully, hopefully everything is going to be fine. No dry goods. If you take a dry goods, it's out. I only got two more and that one. Okay. Let's start. Which is most likely to go... Well, we do have a coupon guy. 
let's start with him because then we might be able 11 is bakery or 2 9 dry goods can't do that we need to take bakery good okay that's bakery now we can't use both coupons 10 that's another bakery okay so far so good <laughs> let's see if we can do the last one as a coupon six that's a produce we have but that's a 412 and that's a produce and a bakery and we can do that produce and a bakery that's seven that's only five bucks and then we have eight more there that's 13 uh, there. and he's pleased by the way we could get eight extra bucks from uh, Dave we missed that one good heavens this is going so well it's going so well it's no not in that one never mind now it's poor Amanda she's been waiting so long and there's nothing left in the store <laughs> Oh, that one is not correct. That's right. Dry goods. Sorry, Amanda. Don't have any. Sorry to say. It's been a very strange day. So, that's it. That's the six. Now, let's see if we have anything we need to throw. Never, never, never. Good. So this is actually what, what I end up with, $184, and that my friend is victory, your success. Your store is making money, organizations around town want to partner with you, and pretty soon you can buy your employees health insurance. <laughs> Most importantly, you're sleeping like a baby until the assistant manager calls you at 3.30 in the morning. He forgot his keys again. <laughs> oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. A new record for me, 184 bucks. Thank you. And thank you for watching. I'll be back with something else next Monday. Bye.